subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get latest videos first. Make proper acquaintance with one of India's first EV electric vehicle charging stations. It's arranged in Nagpur and is one of the four stations that charge Ola's Lady Electric Armada including 200 vehicles of various shapes and sizes. The station houses four superchargers, or quick chargers, and there's a battery swapping station in there also. Other than the standard power supply, the charging station additionally aggregates sun-powered vitality created through solar panels arranged on the rooftop too. A Mahindra E20 plus 100 of which are said to form a part of Ola's electric fleet in Nagpur can be charged to the maximum using the supercharger in about 1 hour and 15 minutes. It takes 37 units of electricity for a full charge and going by the consumption rate of 6 rupees per unit and E20 plus can be charged for about 225 rupees here. On a full charge, the electric Mahindra is about 110 km which gives it an efficiency of about 3 km per unit. At almost 2 rupees per km, the running costs are much lower than a diesel or a petrol car. Heck, it's better than some of the two-wheelers as well. Other than the E20 Plus, the Ola electric fleet presently includes e-rickshaws. Electric buses and e-autos are still undergoing trials and should soon become part of the fleet. While the E20 Plus electric buses and e-autos use fast chargers to replenish their batteries, the e-rickshaws get the provision of replacing their empty batteries with fully charged ones from the station. Any rickshaw can cover about 80 kms before it needs a battery swap. Their batteries can be charged to the maximum in about 3 hours at the battery swap station. Ola has invested over 50 crore rupees in the charging infrastructure in Nagpur that includes about 50 charging stations spread across four outlets. While the stations are currently reserved for Ola fleet only, it can be considered as a pilot project before any stakeholder plans to invest in developing the infrastructure for plug-in hybrid or electric vehicles in India. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to share and like this video. Subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get latest videos first.